Happy Father's Day reactions. Okay, so we are celebrating Father's Day today, and we are celebrating Father's Day by doing dad jokes, because dad jokes aren't so depressing. Now, I'm not going to do all the dad jokes, because I did those last year, so I will put a link in the description to the bit last year. There's more dad jokes there, so if you just need some more, <laughs> there will be more dad jokes out there. This is just going to be reaction, so it's just the stuff that happened this last time, this morning and yesterday morning. You may hear a little dinging every once in a while. That's because I had a tablet on my back, and every time it gets to the punchline, it dings. There it goes. Oh, hey, that worked out really good. So, <laughs> anyways, so this is just reactions, but before I get into that, I want to mention that just like last year, I do have a sponsor this year. Uh, same sponsor as last year. They make hats. They make belts. All this is for men. They make pants for men. Just remember the name, Be Dadzled. It's so good. So anyways, one of the fun things about doing this is that people come up and they give you their jokes too. So I actually got three new jokes this time. Well, I got more, but I just got three that I decided to add to the repertoire. <laughs> so what happened to the cat that swallowed a ball of yarn? She had mittens. <laughs> Why did the bull crash his car? Because he couldn't steer. <laughs> Why did John Wayne buy himself a dachshund? Because he wanted to get along, little doggy. <laughs> So anyways, always this is fun because we're telling jokes and people are laughing and we're carrying on. You still, every time I go out and I do stuff with people, you get into these really interesting combinations of situations. So I walked into Walmart today and there was a lady in there that I work with at my major client. And I walked up and we're hey, we do the fun. You know, go all the way around. I'm all the way. I'm just about ready to get out of the store. And a young man says, so... Do you remember me? And uh, I said, boy, your face is really familiar. He introducing me, he introduces himself again to me. He is the son of the lady I had met earlier in the store. <laughs> I was like, I saw your mom right over there. He said, oh yeah, I guess she's in here. And, and he kind of turned around and she was over there. We're like, hey, so you know, it's all this synchronicity. So we told some dad jokes, it's great. One of my buddies there, I was telling dad jokes. We were carrying on and carrying on. He finally just stopped one of the guys from the automotive and he said, man, I love you. I said, oh, thanks, that's good. I did find out this week that apparently I am part of the new higher orientation at Walmart. So they do, they do tell them if you're in here on Fridays, there's this guy that comes in in costumes every week. He's lots and lots of fun. So that's good. Helps us accomplish all these things. On, uh, there's only one other thing that I didn't mention last time that I thought, you know, given the styling nature of this outfit, I mean, it's pretty obvious what the effect is going to be on the ladies. But just in case no one could tell, We'll zoom in as soon as the dog gets out of the way. These are my chick magnet socks, so. <laughs> Anyways, on a more serious note, just like I mentioned last time, last year, uh, we are at that time in our culture where everybody has to apologize to everybody else for everything all the time. So I just want to go through that ritual again and offer a mea culpa, and I do sincerely apologize for my faux pas. <laughs> Happy Father's Day. <laughs> <laughs> 